The way I would describe my art would be my attempt at a visual depiction of the relationship between the inner self and the outer self and how the environment plays a role in that. My project was inspired by finding the individual voice of everyone who walks this earth. So we speak to each other and we see each other all the time, but I feel like most of the time we send a representative every time we leave the house. It's not really who we are. And so I'm obsessed with having that conversation of who is the person that's in front of me. So I'm using my artistic practice to try to have that conversation. So that's what's inspired this. I've learned that there's a spectrum of perspectives that people walk around with every day regarding who they actually are. One of the things that I've kind of used to try to get that honest answer is a, a small series of questions that ask for these perspectives of how they see themselves. Being a C3 visiting artist has broadened uh, my own perspective of um, how I'm able to communicate who people are through my own artistic practice. Normally, I would just use my own uh, language, my own visual language to say what I think is going on. But with this, I'm dealing with, um, I would say a visitor base that I haven't met before. And so just through those questions, I have to try to get into the minds of these people and try to uh, help support who they say they are. Uh, I was asked a question a few years ago about where I would like to see my work. And uh, I used to think uh, there was a specific museum or gallery I would like to see my work. But from doing this project, I think the destination that I think is ideal for me is as wide as it can be, reaching and touching as many people as, uh, as my work can, can touch and reach.